Hey Ross World, my money makes money. A while ago, I'm gonna say about a month or two ago, a subscriber asked me, they said, what is the best investment app? What is it? Acorns, Stash, Wealthfront, Wealth Simple, Betterment, Robinhood. I'm gonna go with, if I had to choose one, okay, so of course, each of those apps work slightly different but offer the same thing okay they offer for you to invest in all markets okay now we know that betterment and wealthfront and wealth simple are you know entities that you put your money into and they kind of invest it for you okay they assist you up to a certain amount and then you pay a certain fee when you reach a certain threshold now i have videos on that if you want to know all the details and particulars then go and research those videos please Great information, great information. So this is the thing. If I had to choose one, drum roll, brrr, Robin Hood. Now, some of you already knew I was going to say that. Why am I going to say it? Why did I say it? Because Robin Hood is 100% free. That's right. Free. Now, you may say, well, Stash has a better innovative technology when it comes to their portfolios and how they devise things and you can put money into, but you pay for it. Yes, you do, that you pay for. Oh, I love Acorns because it take, um, I invest in fractions and they round up my accounts and I'm, I'm investing with that. And I can also do a weekly or monthly or about monthly amount and start accumulating funds and investment, but there's a fee. Oh, I like wealth fund. I just put 500 down and then I let my money grow. But eventually when you get over that $10,000 or you had a promotion code over that $15,000, there's a fee. Same as with Betterment and Wealth Simple. With Robinhood, if you don't touch Robinhood Gold, you can invest in any stock you want absolutely free. Now, some of you say, well, I like the assorted arrangements of these other guys because they put all these stocks like Apple and Google and YouTube, all these other stocks that I can invest in at a fraction of the price. You're right, but you're paying for it. It all boils down to cost. What is it really going to cost you? Now, you may say, well, I make great money with Stash and the money really doesn't affect my bottom line. It really doesn't affect my pockets. And you probably are 100% correct, but in the end of the day, you're still paying for it. Now, Robinhood is free. If you simply invest into index funds, over the course of time, once again, index funds has always had a return of 7% or better. Okay? The average I'm talking about. So when we're talking about the bottom line, when we're talking about averages and we're talking about free, I have to go with Robinhood, ladies and gentlemen, because you say, well, I don't want to invest in individual stocks or I'm not really that knowledgeable. Then it's going to take some time for you to do some research, for you to do some analysis, okay? Or there's plenty of people on YouTube with channels and they show you their profile. And some of these guys are killing it. They're making 20 to 30 percent. Am I making that much? No. I'm making around 12, 15 percent on average. Every now and again, it'll go up to 20. But I've seen people profiles. I've seen people portfolios on YouTube and they're averaging 20 to 30 percent. They're giving out great returns. And some of you say, well, what website or what channels are you watching so I can go watch them? I know one, dollars and cents. Dollars and cents. Look it up. That's a YouTube channel. I don't know the guy, but he's making great money. I don't care. Listen, you have to understand my channel, guys. I don't care where you get the information from. I'm a, if I have the information, I'm going to give it to you, okay? I'm going to give it to you because I want you to do better. When people say all these things, I'm really not an empty shell. I really do believe that we are a family and we're connected somehow. And I want everyone to do well. I want everyone to do well. So when you ask me a question, it takes me time to get to those videos because I already have a string of videos, okay, that I have to do. And I'm off of that. But when it comes to the best investment app, I'm going to have to go with Robinhood because even those portfolios on Stash, if you look at their ticker, you can put that ticker, most of them, inside of Robinhood and it will pop up the account. The only difference is with Stash, you can only do $5 in a portfolio, where with Robinhood, you have to pay for that entire stock. And that's fine. Save up for it and pay for it because in the end, it's free. 
Every month you're paying for Stash. Every month you're paying for Acorns, okay? So understand what you're getting yourself into. And are these fees that high? No. The reason why these apps are doing so great, Betterment, Wealth Simple, Wealthfront, Acorns, and Stash, is because they have very, very little fees. And they are a great way. Yes, I do Wealthfront. Yes, I do Stash. Yes, I do Acorns. Yes, I do Robinhood. But if I had to pick one, it would be Robinhood simply because it's free and I can invest into anything. I'm out.